Hey folks let's see an interesting and practical tutorial together. To select empty cells and fill them with their own top row. You must press Ctrl and A on the keyboard so that the entire table is selected. Then press Ctrl and G and click on the special key from the go to window. Now you have to click on the blanks option and click OK. By doing this, all the empty cells will be selected in between. As they are in the selection mode, you must type an equal in the formula bar and select the upper cell. Here I select cell C3. Now hold the control key down and press the enter key. I am sure you are shocked by the result. Use the hot key to automatically adjust the size of the columns. You must press control and A on the keyboard, hold down the alt key and press the H, O, and I. If you click on a cell and then press the control and R keys, it will repeat the value of the previous column. If you select the number of cells and press the control and R keys, it will repeat the value of the cells in the side column. Now let's go to transpose. There are three ways to do this. The first way is to copy a number of cells from a column and hold the Alt key on the keyboard and press the E and then S. In the paste special window, tick the transpose option and click OK. Another way is to use the paste option at the top of the page or right click on the cell and click the transpose option. A very good use of the transpose option is that you can change the direction of the entire table using transpose. Honestly, I didn't forget to say one more thing. See these cells are all initialized via formulas. Now first select all the cells and click on the first cell of the table and select the paste value option from the paste option section. With this, the formulas will be deleted and all the cells will be written data. I hope you find this tutorial helpful. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel.